Today on Food for the Soul, I will be showing you how to do chicken leg lollipops. Man, man, man. Hey, the first thing I do is I take my scissors and I go around the bottom part of the drumstick all the way around, cut all the way through it. Just like that. And make sure you don't press too hard because sometimes you can cut all the way through the bone. So I'm just taking my time going through each one of them, making sure I cut through each one of these chicken legs. So the next thing I do is I take my scissors and I cut this big vein right here. There's a big vein and you will never know how many veins is in a chicken leg until you start cutting through one. Oh my God, there's a lot of veins in a chicken leg that you have no idea when it's totally cooked. And right after cutting the veins off, what you do is you pull down, you just like that, the same way that I'm putting down, make it look like a lollipop. And it will stand up on its own when you pull it down all the way. And the top, you can keep that or take it off. I always take mine off just like that it's real simple to do you just pull some with a little bit of strength take the scissors and pop it off and again you just repeat the process over again take that vein and you just cut the vein just like that there's gonna be some small ones with it too it's gonna be a lot of them just knock it off just knock it off and just repeat the process over again And there you go again. You just pull down, pull down, and you just pop that top. Use a little strength, and it stands up just like that. So what I'm going to do is knock out the rest of these right here, and I'll be back. So it's time to season my drumstick lollipops. So I lost some recording, but what I did was I seasoned my uh, lollipops drumstick with uh, onion powder, garlic powder, salt, pepper, and seasoning salt. All that together is a blend of a good all-purpose season. All right, so it's time for the frying process. What I have here is cornstarch and flour half and half so I take my lollipop drumstick the bottom part or the top part whatever you want to uh, call it coat it all the way shake off the SS fl uh, flour and I drop it into the grease just like that uh, they are gonna fall down and you would need them to fall down to cook the bone part too so however they are they will stand up when they're all the way done. Just like that. Just repeat the process. This is this is gonna be some good lollipop drumsticks. Oh my god. All this deliciousness and all this goodness. All right, my lollipop drumsticks are done. What I have here is some buffalo sauce and some barbecue sauce where I'm gonna bless these lollipop drumstick with. I want them to look like lollipops because lollipops always have some kind of color to it. So mine's is gonna be red and a redder barbecue sauce is a red type purple, so like that. All right, now it's time to bless my lollipop drumsticks with some barbecue sauce. Oh yes, that good old barbecue sauce. And look how good that look. Mm, mm, mm. Man. So 
So what I'm doing now is frying the rest of my drumsticks the same way I did the others. Just like that. And see how good they're standing up? They're standing up perfectly good. That's the way you want them to stand up. Cook it like this for like five minutes and drop all of them down bone part two. Alrighty, my last batch is done and these drumsticks are looking delicious. So what I do now is I repeat the same process of putting a sauce on each one of them just like that and I'm gonna come back and plate it up and show you the plate up and the final part of the video. Time for the plate up. First thing I do is take a spoon and I bless the plate half and half, one of it, one half with barbecue sauce, just like that. And I just use the same spoon since I'm doing it at the his house. And I just use the buffalo sauce, just like that. You can use how less or how much you want. But that's the way that I'm just going to do mine for right now. Nextly is I get my lollipop drumsticks for the barbecue. I just set the uh, barbecue drumsticks on the barbecue side. And they stand up so pretty. Look at that. Just like that. And they will stand up pretty. And... What you also can do is get you a side of ranch with it and some celery with it to dip and that would be off the chain. And I just got me a little bit parsley. I'm just sprinkling like that. So sprinkle me, man. Sprinkle me, man. Just like that for presentations. And there you go, lollipop drumsticks from scratch. Man, 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 I, I have buffalo and barbecue over here. Don't forget to get them good size with it, some good ranch and some good celery with it to dip. But hey, I really do hope you like this video. Uh, please leave me a comment. Please subscribe to my channel. Give me a thumbs up. Let me know how I'm doing. But don't forget to read the bible verse at the bottom of the description to also feed that soul and i'll see you next time on food for the soul baby booyah